Okay, so you have your binder. You are going to put your multiplication table in the front pocket. Then you have your math lab log. You will have about 10 pages. You will put those in your log. Notice that they are in order, number order, all the way to 55. Okay, then you have your notebook paper. That's the next thing in your binder. You need to number each page on the outside corner of the page away from the um, hole punch and divide it in fours. Turn the page and you will put a two in the top outside corner and divide the page into fours. And continue. You have three and divide your page into fours. This will allow you to have t uh, space to work each problem out in MATLAB. Okay, you go to four, five. I can hear myself talk. You just, you're recording. Okay, so six, divide the page into fourths. Seven, divide the page into fourths. And so on until you get to 50. And you will do all of the lined notebook papers until you get done. Then you're going to work on the table of contents for your interactive notebook. There are four pages of this. That's the next thing in your notebook. Then you have your printer paper with hole punches in it, and you're going to number those continuously on the outside corner of your notebook. Four, five, six, Seven. Notice it's on the outside corner of each page, and you're going to number all the pages, front and back, until you get to 50. That is the part, history part of your interactive notebook. 